It's kind of hard to give this thing the conclusion or like the ending that I feel like it it needs and deserves. I mean, obviously, not only is a bubble coming to an end for us and me, but this is also the end of my rookie season. And looking back on everything that I was able to accomplish and experience, it's just, it's really crazy. And it's cool to see how far you can come in a year and all that can happen in a year. With the 20th pick in the 2019 NBA Draft, the Boston Celtics select Matisse Thibault from the University of Washington. I take pride in doing whatever it takes to win. Whatever that means for my role is what I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hang my hat on. I feel like that was one of the reasons why I stayed in college all four years was just so I could be as ready as possible when I came to the next level. Like as a kid, you, you dream of it, but how many people get to see their dreams become a reality? So I'm incredibly lucky. This guy is going to be so good defensively. Bible with a rejection of Walker. Bible forces it up and buries it for his first NBA field goal. Matisse Bible. This kid right here, he's very high IQ defensive player. Bible the steal, tracked by Siakam. He can forget it. Guys who are defensive player of the years or top defensive players in college. Thibel behind his back to Embiid. Well done by the rookie Matisse Thibel. And that is the one thing that always translates to the NBA. Over a Baca. Thibel for three. Got it. Matisse Thibel. Thibel for three. Got it. Matisse Thibel, a rookie career high 18. Across the board, I think as a defender, you want everyone you match up against to, to have to respect you. And to be earning their respect helps me to take that confidence and carry it over into games where we're playing against other guys of that caliber. Five with a steal, five with the breakaway, and a two hand jam! How do I pack all this stuff? This is. This is. Cr oh my god. I showed up with no extra room in the suitcase. And we've added things. <sighs> Let the work begin. So my dad made me steal a whole bunch of these NBA masks because he really, really wanted some. To the NBA, I'm sorry that I took so many. Uh, you can just take it out of my paycheck, but you understand I had to do it for my dad. I packed all these books. You want to know how many pages I read? Zero. I thought I was going to come out here and read and be productive, taking notes and stuff, but then in came the vlog and out went the time to read. I'm not sure if anyone can relate to this, but you ever pack up all your clothes, including the dirty clothes, and then even lay out your clothes that you're gonna wear for like the plane ride, but then forget the fact that you're wearing clothes that are dirty, that have to also go away? I do this, I think I do this every time. So now... <laughs> Back to Philly we go. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Thank you. Good, Be careful now. So yeah, I'm trying to get reacclimated to the real world. I'm not in it for attention. I'm not in it for the riches. I'm not in it for the luxury. I'm not in it for the kisses. I'm not in it for the whips. I'm not in it for the cribs. I'm not in it for the jewelry. 
It is what it is since I was a kid I wanted to grow up and be something big That's my only wish as a young and I was told to take what you get And don't throw a fit, ain't that a bitch Maybe I really could live at my dream Maybe I could play for the winning team Maybe I could move up to the big league I've gotten shot up by my favorite YouTuber Casey Neistat One day I'm telling myself I'll be great Next day I'm thinking about all my mistakes One day I'm telling myself don't complain Next day I'm running from all of my it's pain like that village you get when you can't move In a nightmare I'm scared I try to keep running But it keeps on coming and it's taking it to light Yeah, I'm just hoping that it fights fair You don't, you don't have to do this just because your ruling doesn't mean you're ruthless now that i'm down on my knees and i'm begging for mercy i'm begging for peace what happens when i'm gone are you gonna keep singing this song yeah will you just tell me the truth because it feels like you've been lying all along you challenge people to educate themselves actually see and create real change the more powerful it is for you i got one question now with the uh anthem the iron is hot for you, I got one question. For you, oh, I got one question. Only one question. Will you remember me? Uh, will you remember me? Will you remember me? Will you remember me? Yeah. Will you remember me? Will you remember me? Will you remember me? Yeah. Will you remember me? Will you remember me? Will you remember me? Yeah. Will you remember me? So even though the bubble series is over and the bubble videos are done, I still want to keep making videos. And actually, I have some stuff I'm working on right now that I'm really excited to show you guys. But before I post anything more after this, I need your help trying to come up with an idea of what to name this next phase of videos or chapter or series, whatever you want to call it. But leave in the comments below what you think I should name it and and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.